to get one thing straight. This is purely for fun and non-profit. And all the voices you hear are all down behind then Twinkle Phoenix herself. Huh. Anyway, let's get started. Jelly Iggy. Huh? Are they really talking to us? I know, right? I didn't believe it at first, but I realized they really are real. Look at them! Whoa! Hey, put me down! Don't go manhandling me! Or oh, woman handling me! Who the heck are you people? Do you mind? We're doing honey pop! Play to here and you're interrupting! <laughs> Sorry, I thought it'd be fun if we joined you! <laughs> you're a bit, um, loud. I never ever thought there'd be somebody louder than Jelly Icky. It must be the end of the world. Oh no, not at all, Jelly Icky 2.0. That's just Sickle. Sickle's always like that. Yeah. Huh? Is Yoshiki, are you alright? I'm just, um, trying to come to terms with what the hell I'm seeing. There are two talking things. I told you, we're not things. I'm a Jelly Iggy and he's a Jelly Iggy 2.0. How hard to comprehend the repressions. Means jelly. I mean actual jelly you can eat. No! You can't go eat me, us. Oh! Hi! Sorry. Anyway, I'm sure we can all get along for this playthrough. Let's go, shall we, everybody? Oh, well, yes, of course. Let's go for it. Huh? Yeah, totally. Are you serious? You're okay with them joining us? It'll be interesting. Let's just go for it. Uh-huh. Uh... Are you, uh, Yosho Dicky or Yosho... What? What's his name? <laughs> his name's Yoshiki! <laughs> oh, right. Close your mouth. Let's just start, shall we? Let's see how far we can get without me getting angry at some of you. Anyway, this, of course, is Honey Pop. We're going to be playing as, as a girl! Huh? I'm a boy. Huh? Uh, also, I'm a boy. Uh, I'm a boy too. And uh, there's three boys and only two girls. So, exactly! So, let's play as a woman to even it out. She doesn't look like a love fairy. Ha! Wait till you see later when she breaks and runs into our room. Then you'll be sing singing a different tune. Move aside, everybody. I want to say. Ha! Hello! Wow. Okay. Could I get you to maybe take it down a notch? I'm right here. I know you're right there. You're like really, really cute. Know, right? It's crazy. <laughs> My name is Kiyu. Nice to meet you. Hmm. That's a weird name. Oh, thanks. No, that's great. I have a weird name. Look, girl. Are you gonna be alright? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. <laughs> kind of like somebody else. Yoshiki can't stop staring. Yoshiki? Yoshiki, what are you staring at? Uh, no, nothing. I can tell you what he's staring at. He's staring at the goddamn me. What's wrong? Seriously, you're gonna have to get used to the fact I talk. Uh, let's let's just ignore him. Also, it's a pleasure to meet you, Naomi, Seiko, and of course you, Yoshiki. Uh huh. Uh huh. So Yoshiki, what do you think of that one? Doesn't she look pretty? Uh huh. Yoshiki. 
we lost your case somewhere along the line. Oh, I leave him alone. It's taking him a, a little bit of time to come to terms with what is going on, especially with these two. And it's a pleasure to meet you two as well. I really like you. You're extremely nice and polite. You're just extremely loud. Why, thank you! Anyway, let's continue. No, no, I'm chill, chill! Shh. That's a fat load of shit and you know it. It is? Huh? I could see how uncomfortable you are right now from space. Hmm, wait. You know what? This might actually work. Yeah. Yeah! Oh man, this is your lucky day, sister! Listen, I gotta go, but we'll meet again real soon. Trust me. Night! Night! Q! No, I mean, when you wear a costume like that for me, uh, why on earth would I even wear that sickle? I'm no raisin. <laughs> hey, you, rise and shine. We've got work to do. Huh? What the hell was that I girl said, wearing? Get up. Huh? Wish you just have Yoshi Key do the answers for this one. He's so much out of it. It's like he just woken up. <laughs> I did wake up. You barely, I barely got out of bed a couple minutes ago for you to drive me in here to meet these, these, these. Jolly Icky and Jolly Icky 2.0, not it. We're boys. Seriously, where'd you get this friend of yours? He's slightly rude, staring constantly at a jelly. Do you mind? Also, close your mouth. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. He looks like he wants to eat me. I can assure you, Yoshiki doesn't want to eat you. Yoshiki's still, um... I've never seen a talking plush before. Oh, come on, Yoshiki. You're bound to see those talking plushies. And Ayumi's. Ayumi doesn't have that many plushies. So you help in Ayumi's house. Uh, I mean, what? Damn it. <laughs> you were trying to see if Ayumi likes talking plushies. Or likes plushies in general because you wanted to get her a present. <clears throat> Oh, look at his face! His face suddenly went bright red! Oh, Jelly Iggy, leave him alone. Before long, you're gonna end up getting another person hating you. I was, ju I was just being honest, and Sickle said it first. Anyway, we got Q to deal with. Also, Naomi, are those? Don't even go there, Sickle. Huh? Oh my, I agree with Jelly Iggy 2.0, don't go there. But Naomi, you can see her! Yosuke, look! Look down there! Look what you can see! Uh, uh. Yosuke? I'm dear. Naomi's Yosuke gonna be alright. He's all red in the face. Stop telling people when I'm red! Uh, just play your goddamn game! Haha! <laughs> I can't handle the women! Anyway... Alright, alright, I'll be up in them. Um... Am I gonna have to pull the covers off? Probably. I'm afraid not. This is totally happening. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> it's Kiyu from the bar. Wow, she's certainly full of herself. Uh, yeah, but you have brown hand, not wings, silly. <laughs> Clever disguise, right? I can change my hair any color I want. It's pretty sweet. If you can't tell by now, I'm a fairy. Well, a love fairy to be exact. Is that why she's got those weird things? Those weird white pieces on the back of her wings, Naomi? I'm not sure. I've never actually heard of a love fairy. Neither did we when we first played it. No, this is the very first time we ever met a love fairy, but we got to like Q, didn't we? Q is just weird. <laughs> oh then, she's my kind of girl. <laughs> Oh, why am I still here? Yoshiki, what did you just say? Uh, nothing, just carry on. Oh, oh it's alright, Yoshiki. It's alright. Uh, ask her, question, what exactly is a love fairy? Good question, I'm glad you asked. You see, as a love fairy, it's my job to help poor gals like you out with the ladies. It's just what I do. I don't like to brag, but I'll have you know I have a very impressive track record. All of my previous clients are basically walking babe magnets now. You, though. <clears throat> what 
let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment yet. Huh, what does she get out of it? Man, you and all the questions. Can't a fairy just help a sister out? We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? Oh, I've been on several dates with Naomi. <coughs> Yoshi Key, don't choke on the drink. Seriously, every time I give you a drink, you always end up choking. What is it that makes you choke? <laughs> Oh, Jelly Oogie, don't laugh at him. Well, Miss Circle, don't call me Miss. My name is Circle. All right, Circle. It was just the fact that you said about you and Naomi going on dates. I guess it came as quite a shock to him. Dad, and he's still staring at Jelly Oogie. What? Stop staring at me, man. The ladies can stare at me all they want because they're ladies, but you know you're a man. Huh. <sighs> Fine date! Oh my god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? Alright, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. Someone has to show you the ropes. I know a place nearby that's open pretty late. You'll love it. Or not, I don't care. Alicia's full out on a date, Naomi! <laughs> but Naomi, we're going on a date! But Naomi, remember, you're the only girl with my, for my heart. What? Nothing, Naomi. Alright, I'll try to make this quick. This is the date grid. Oh, These little pieces are called tokens. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. For a successful date, you have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the middle of the grid. Uh, which ones am I supposed to do, Naomi? Uh, allow me to show you. Say, go, it's these ones right here. Those ones? Uh huh. Just grab that one and pull it across to where the teardrop is. Like, well done. See, easy. Each of the four types of affection tokens represents a particular trait. The orange ones represent romance. Blue is talent. Green is flirtation, and red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Of course, matching four or five tokens will get you even more affection. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid. The red ones. Uh, which ones? These ones by here, Seiko. See this one? Uh-huh. Now pull it down to the bottom pink one. Like this? Uh-huh. Well done! Sweet. Thank you! Okay, what's next? Oh, right! Let me cover the other token types real quick. The pink hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. The gold bells are joy tokens. You'll get an extra move by matching those. Very useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as best you can. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts, I'm guessing I need to explain that too. Here, I'll hook you up with one of mine. It's on the house. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. So go ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. I can do this! These ones, right? Jalyuki 2.0? That's right! Just pull it up all the way! Well done! Now give okay. her the teddy! Now go ahead and give that date gift to me. Oh, I'm so excited! Not only will this work with you? Oh, sicko. Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Oh, <laughs> and thanks to a little fairy magic, you'll never actually lose them. So you can use them on your next date too. <laughs> Is that cool or what? That's right, awesome! All right, I've gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date so you can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry. I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. <laughs>